This is the Rasadar Diving Center in the coastal city of Al Hawariya. The club team is preparing for an unusual mission in the Mediterranean Basin. Today, scuba diving is not for fun, it is rather for cleaning the sea. The beautiful sea is a gift that we must take care of. Divers should take action against marine debris because they are the first to realize the devastating effects underwater. Ferris is the youngest diver. After 11 dives, the 12-year-old boy has become familiar with this area. Ferris has joined his father to remove marine debris. I am not afraid to dive to remove bottles and plastic. If we don't do it, there will be no clean sea in the future. Tunisia's most talented and experienced divers have come to support the project. Many are shocked when they observe the seabed. We're working together underwater to control the vast area. It's incredible how tourists can cause marine pollution. It's even worse than we had expected. Foreign divers who live in the North African state have joined their Tunisian friends. Germain and his team are not only picking up trash they see during their dives, they are also reporting the trash and recording data for a scientific project. Analyzing the recorded data will help experts understand the phenomenon of marine pollution and limit its impact on the environment. Hundreds of plastic and glass bottles were removed. However, thousands of dangerous objects and tons of rubbish could not be taken out. Every year, 8 million tons of plastics enter the oceans and seas, but only 5% of it stays at the surface. This means that 95% of it is still underwater. My second dive in this beautiful landscape was for a noble cause. I finally realized the threat of the tide of trash and how animals have been reported as entangled or trapped in fishing line, nets and other plastic items. Every year, the initiative of scuba diving to remove debris here in Al Hawariya is attracting more and more volunteers from all regions across the country. Activists are now planning to organize similar events on the Tunisian coast to reduce marine pollution. Adam Shabashi, CGTN, Hawaria, Tunisia.